Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem Path the Radiance. We're here in the, well, the, basically the first serious level, I guess you'd say, of the game. Oscar here is going to hit this sword dude, since so uh, lances have an advantage against swords. Which means people with lances are harder to hit against, well, if you have a sword, you're, it's harder to hit people that uh, carry lances. Let's take this guy out. Ah! Get him, Mike! Yeah. And we got him. Okay, this guy's going to probably come over here. Yeah, he's going to try and take out Boyd, but no worries. There's only one of them. Ah. Boyd's going to need to heal here pretty soon, though. So, let's be here. Yeah, why not? Oh no! Fuck! We got him. During these early levels, it's kind of, well, you just gotta look out to your stats to make sure you're not going to overboard. This game is very stat driven. Well, I shouldn't say that. Pretty much every game is stat driven. I mean, that's what code is, right? Just a bunch of numbers. But this game has the stats pretty much at the forefront. Ah! And I'm taking chances I shouldn't here. Because Boyd could have missed, and that guy could have retaliated and killed him. I think. Anyways. So, move Tanya up here. We want Oscar here. Yeah, he should be able to take a hit from this guy. This guy here won't move, so you don't have to worry about that because he's protecting that square. So he's not going to move. This guy will, though. So I'm going to move this guy into here. Uh, Boyd can go up here and heal. Yeah. I can go up here, too. And I can have to heal? Yes, he will. His last Volinary. Okay. We'll end that turn for now. Uh-oh. Get him! Ow. Hook. So, he has eight damage left. Who could use the experience more? Ike's level 3, Boyd is level 2, Oscar's level 3. So I'm going to go with Oscar, or Boyd here, even though he has an axe. Yeah, 72% chance is not really one you want to take, but I'm going to do it anyways. Since, well, if Boyd does miss, he's going to survive, and I could just have Ike or Oscar finish him off. So. Nah. Get him. See, he did miss. But at least I took the chance of him getting the experience instead of Ike or Oscar, who are higher level. I'm gonna have Oscar take him out. Get him! And we get some experience. Alright, now what I wanna do with the boss is. Right here. Yeah. Because he only can attack one square because he has an iron axe. So he can't attack squares adjacent. Only here, 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 and behind him. So he only can attack this square right here. Let's see what can Tammy do against him. Oh, uh, she's still gonna kill him. Nuts. I thought she'd at least weaken him, but unfortunately that's not the case. Um, 7 and 7 is 14, so he's... Yeah. Okay, if I attack him, he's going to counterattack. And then attack... Okay, yeah, I might as well. Get old Mike! Heh, <laughs> you're nothing but a boy. Well, every brat needs a beating now and then. Are you ready for it? Not today. You want to run away? Now is your chance. <laughs> Imagine that, you sassy me. Don't that beat all. Yeah, basically you get a dialogue if you fight a boss and uh, with certain characters, so... Alright, get Titani up here just in case. She can rescue Ike in, if he gets into trouble. All mounted people can rescue. We'll get more on that later. Yeah, and he heals up since he's uh, standing on that spot. Heals him every turn. 
Now that's a critical, my friend. Err. I meant for better than this. I don't want to die here. Well, too bad. You threaten me, I take your life. And Ike levels up. Alright. Level 4. Mm, not bad stat growth. Magic is pretty much useless, right? So, um, what should I get rid of? I'm gonna get rid of that. Uh, no. Basically, now that we defeated the boss, we take our main character, which is Ike here, and he can seize that thing to end the map. And clear the map. Yep. This is what we want to do. That's the end of it. Ike, are you alright? Yeah, I'll be fine. You know, you surprised me to think that you've come so far. Look at my father, though. I've still got such a long way to go. There's nothing you can do about that. After all, Commander Grail is... Huh? What about my father? Oh, nothing. Nothing? Now I'm really curious. Don't worry, you'll learn all about it someday. <laughs> I know what she's talking about. Hey, I, that wasn't bad for your first battle. Not as flash as my first time, though. <laughs> Yeah, you were a real standout. I'll never forget the sight of you so keyed up you broke your own axe. <laughs> Oscar, dang it, you didn't have to bring that up. Anyway, I congrats on finishing your first mission. Welcome to the group. Everyone's alright. Then let's get going. I'm sure Miss has a nice hot meal waiting for us. Cool, cool. Save the game. Battle Gears, Chapter 2, Rescue. This is, we're back at our fort. Oh, it's Sandy, so this is where you've been, is it? Rice, are you sure you're, are you sure you're well enough to be out? Yes, my fever is completely gone. Are you sure? You still look a little, a bit unsteady on your feet, if you ask me. Well, I've been in bed for almost a week. I doubt anyone would be in top form, even you, my friend. <laughs> Certainly hope that's all it is. In any case, until you're back at full speed, you won't be doing any work. We mercenaries, we're mercenaries after all, and even the small slaps invites death. Right? I know, I know. My apologies to the rest of the team then. It looks like I'll be recuperating for a while longer. It's for the best. Take your time and get fully rested and restored. You are our sole staff wielder, Rice. The harder our work, the more we depend on you to be at our side. Thank you for your kind words. Oh, by the way, that paper you've been carrying around, is it a letter? I intended to go into town this afternoon. I can deliver it for you if you'd like. Oh no, this letter is for you, Titania. For me. Not more than a little while ago, I went out for a walk around the yard, and a man I've never seen before came up to me and said, Give this to the Red Trust tonight. How curious. I wonder what it is. I imagine it's a thank you letter from the people of Caldea or something to that effect. Oh no, how dare they! Tanya, what's the matter? What did the letter say? Rice, right, take this letter to Oscar and tell him to prepare for combat and wait for me. I have to go out for a moment. Uh, but Titania, I'll be right back. I'm counting on you. What on earth could that letter have said? Everyone, come quickly. Hey, Rice, how are you feeling? What is it? Why are you so agitated? Has something happened? It's Mist and Rolf. They, they've been taken by bandits. What? What are you talking about? The two of them went out early this morning to gather wildflowers. I'm sure they're not back yet, but... Or sure they're not back yet, but... Earlier by the gate, a man asked me to deliver a letter to Tanya. It was from a group of bandits. Kidnappers! What are we going to do? Let me see it. Well, if only I'd known. He didn't seem like a bad person. Hmm, I get it. They're after revenge. They want retribution for the other day at the village. Caldea, was it? Hmm, taking children as hostages? What cowards! Blast! Wait, Ike, where do you think you're going? I'm going to get missed. But no, Titania, she said she'd be right back. You're supposed to get ready and wait for her. And do you honestly think we've got time to wait? I'm going. 
What do you think you're going to do on, on your own, rookie? Hold it, I'm coming too. Stop, both of you. I, I'm going with you. Oh, come on. Wait, this is crazy. Do you think you can just ignore the deputy commander's orders? The, word for, the, the road forks here. Well, which way do we go? How am I supposed to know that? Hold it. Are you saying you don't know where we're going? Unbelievable. You better learn to think before you act, you moron. Shut your mouth, Floyd. You think you can make me? Come on. For both of you, this is no time to be fighting. I figured we'd find you like this. What are you two doing? So you're coming after all. It's not like you two chambermaids to be disobeying orders. What's the world coming to? Oscar, you know this road, don't you? Which way do we go? Well, next time, guys. Godspeed, stay frosty. See y'all.